So this video is a long time in the making. Um, uh, several months ago, like last spring, um, Kale from Pornus Studios uh, purchased a double vibe drum from me. And we did a little horse trading because I saw on his, his YouTube channel, uh, Pornus Studios, uh, that he had some pretty cool do-it-yourself projects to make different music instruments and things like this. And I liked like his mini amp and things like that. So we did a little horse trading with the drum and some of his stuff. And uh, of course, I'm over here in, in Austria right now. And due to the lockdown, it took like three months to, to get my end of the trade. But one thing I traded for was like this little uh, this little mini amplifier made from an old cigar box. And uh, I I hooked it up. It's really cute. It's uh, and you open it up and it's got all the stuff in there and volume control and squelch and all these things and so I just uh, I happen to have this uh, pickups uh, for hand pans or for uh, steel tongue drums and I just taped them onto the bottom of this because my drums are made of uh, stainless steel so you can't use a, a magnet to, to stick them down so I just taped them on and uh, We'll see how it sounds and turn it on. There's the speaker. Uh, turn that over. And so I get it hooked up to a vibe drum in uh, E Akibono or F Akibono. So it's pretty cool, it just runs off of a little 9 volt battery that's in there so you can take it anywhere. I think it works a little better with uh, stringed instruments. Um, I think you need a little more power for, uh, for vibe drums. But, uh, and uh, the other thing I got from him was this uh, a stringed instrument and it came as a kit. And this is, this is called a diddly bow, and you kind of make it yourself. They, they send you all the parts and stuff you need, and then you've got to do a little woodwork here and there and things like that. And uh, never having uh, played or made a stringed instrument before, um, it took me a bit of time. I kind of finished the post here and put some marks on it for whatever that is. And uh, the, the thing I noticed, though, is I didn't get the... I got the stick too low on the box, so the distance between the string and the sticks is a long, long way. So I should have moved that up a little bit. But uh, this is called a diddly bow, and uh, I was supposed to get one that had a pickup in it. That was the idea, was to hook up the diddly bow to the mini amp, not a uh, vibe drum to the mini amp. But uh, somehow we missed that. We're going to get that fixed. I can't play a string instrument. Um, I've never tried. and. Uh, after trying this one for a little bit, I realized that string instruments are probably not for me. But um, here's how it sounds. I guess you can wiggle it a little bit. <laughs> it gives a funny sound. Yeah, it seems like a good instrument for playing like bluegrass music and things like that. Um, yeah, I'll play around with it, but uh, that's kind of how it sounds. And it's really fun. You just get this little kit, and it comes with the, with the, it's made from a cigar box. And it comes with the box and the string and instructions and everything you need to, to make it. You need to do a little uh, wood filing here and there to kind of like shape the, the neck a little bit and things. But it's, it's fun. Um, one of these days I'll... Maybe I'll learn how to play it. I, I, 
you feel like I, I need a, a rocking chair to play this drum for some, or to play this uh, this diddly bow for some reason, I feel like I would be sitting on a porch in the south on a on a rocking chair, uh, with a jug of moonshine. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, this is pretty cool. So uh, Kale is uh, is really happy with his his double five drum. I'm really happy with this. Uh, it looks pretty cool. It was fun to make. Uh, it was a nice little project. Gave me something to do during the lockdown period. And so, uh, check them out. Uh, Kale at Pornus Studios. Okay, that's it from uh, from Vibe Drums. All right, cheers. <laughs>